It's a critical night for Pueblo's bid to bring a short season minor league baseball team to town. County commissioners gave a presentation to city council tonight asking for the board's support of the project. News has Andy Cohen first broke this story for us earlier this month. He joins us live from the Whip River Walk with new details about the proposal and a look at why tonight's council meeting was so important, Andy. Yeah, Elizabeth, Pueblo County actually has an option to buy an old warehouse just on the other side of Lake Elizabeth here, and that's where they would like to build this downtown stadium. But they're going to need the city's support for that project, and they're working under a pretty tight deadline here. You see, the minor league ball club owner has to give minor league baseball two years notice about moving his team, and the current contract that he has in the city where they're currently located, it expires in 2020. A 2800 seat stadium right on the Riverwalk and next door to the historic power plant that's about to be redeveloped. That's the plan county commissioners pitched to Pueblo City Council. We're asking the city to work with us along with Urban Renewal to collect future tax payments uh, to help pay back the, the bond to pay for it. They explained that the stadium will not use any money that's about to be collected from ballot issue 1A. Instead, they take out a loan and repay it with sales taxes collected at new hotels that the baseball team owner wants to build downtown. Some council members like the idea. It is truly a vision that, uh, you know, is pretty easy to get behind. Others voice their doubts. I'm all for this, but I got some real, real gut concerns about this whole thing. This deal needs city support because of the tax increment financing plan intended to pay for the stadium. The proposed hotel sites are all vacant properties, which aren't collecting any sales taxes. They're the empty police annex next door to the Brews House, the parking lot next to SRDA, and a pad site on the Riverwalk. Uh, we don't get it unless we build it. And uh, not only that, that stadium built with public money will belong to the public. Before the presentation ended, a few council members suggested putting off a decision until the commissioners can give them more details. We can't be rushed on something this big. We've got to have a chance to work through that. And so, um, so that's what I would ask for. And, and if it takes a little bit extra time, I think it's, it's the right thing to do. A Pueblo City Council ordinarily meets on Monday nights, but there is a holiday next Monday. It's Memorial Day, and so they've moved that meeting till next Tuesday. And so what the county commissioners would like is to see the city council put a resolution on that agenda in support of this baseball plan. Watching out for you, Pueblo. Andy Cohen, News 5.